<laughs> hey, it's the Scotch Test Dummies. I'm Scott. Oh, Bart here. Westland Single Malt Gariana Edition. Mm, we like the American Single Malt. We're going to test it. Gariana. Yeah, I was trying to think of something different. <laughs> All right, we're in colorful box. So this is the fifth edition. I don't know where we're at. Um, 2020 commemorative release. So maybe this is even a year what's, old. What, what's what? They got a lot of fractals. We got fractals all over the side of the box. Hold on, just a second. You can look at it. Oh, thank you. Fractals. Let's just pick this one up. Uh, fifth edition. American single malt whiskey, 50% ABV, distilled from 100% malted barley in Seattle, Washington. Oh, it's well charted tradition. Maybe that's why. Showing like a chart. We've had um, actually a few Westlands sent to us by, we'll say, John. Way to I'm go, not sure, John. I'm not sure if we've ever named his full name or not, or if he wants that out there, but yeah. Uh, he, and he sent a few different ones, but he's never sent a Garyana. John Kennedy. <laughs> Just kidding. It's not. John Kennedy. <laughs> I was trying to think, oh. what's the most famous John I know? So, what? Uh, what? Westlands. Oh, they're tight. That, they're, they're tight screw tops. Yeah. John Kennedy. Um, it's Elton John. We could flip it around. Be yeah. Elton. Elton John. Wow, look at you with the tap, tap, tap. On my bedroom door. Oh. There's John John. <laughs> All right, this is now. What makes the Gariana special? Well, this is the fifth. So, but I do remember it's a special oh, wood. Yes, was it? I think so. Enduring and stoic Quercus Gariana, the Pacific Northwest native oak, stands as a testament to terroir and perseverance. Native oak. Its mighty trunk sheathed in thick mossy bark. Ooh, wasn't sure which trunk they were it's talking roots, about there. Like our roots are dug deep into the earth of this place. There's some alliteration. Above it towers steadfast and unmoving, but below is the persistent draw, the low churning hum of life and energy pulling up from the soil. When it comes Westland, with it comes get Westland's Gariana, an exploration of Pacific Northwest provenance that brings with it a compelling new voice. Blah, blah, single blah, 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 blah. I never got a chance to blah, blah you before. You were not too long. Non-chill filtered, no coloring added. Velvet Elvis. <laughs> wow. The I old belt, the old safe one. Yeah, I should have velvet elvis you. Yeah, although there was some interesting alliteration Ooh. there. That's almost like a sandalwood. That's almost like um, Ooh. Wow. Uh, the uh, the Japanese oak. Um, Mizunara. Oh, dang it. You got it before. I was thinking Ikarua. Yeah, a little bit of a sandalwood note. Yeah. And even the, and, uh, uh, the last. Touch of barrel char, too. The last one, that Ambrana, which I made a mistake. I think I said I thought it was from Africa. Someone pointed out uh, Brazil. We haven't posted that one yet, but I brought it up in something else I was talking about, and someone said Brazil. Dang it. But yeah, it's almost a sandalwood, rosy. That's nice. That's a floral. Rose. Yeah. Maybe a touch of cherry rind. Huh. Beech nut. That is good. It has a very nice nose, very oaky. Mm. A little bit of cinnamon. Well, well, well. I'm holding. This is spectacular. There's a beautiful velvety open right from the get-go mm -hmm. mm. with a sweet underlay. There's some other things I'm going to have to come back to. Like a sugary trickle, mm. trickle still mm -hmm. feathering out. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, first sip, very nice. Tobacco, mm. I'm going to add on to some of your notes there. Multi blind, I would think Mizanara oak. It's so much of that kind of sandalwood, kind of that just different oak character. Cinnamons, I like that, that sugary, treacle, 
caramelized sugar, yeah. caramel. And I just got the cinnamon. A little bit of raspberry. That. Ooh. There's a lot. There's a lot going really on. Really good. I don't. I. I thought I didn't like their other Giriana one as much. This is great. It's called Outpost Range. Anytime I see that, there was a movie with Sean Connery called Outpost, and I like it. It's kind of like a high noon riff in space. I don't think we've done a Giriana. I thought we did one because we totally blew the pronunciation, or I did. Yeah, I think we've done one Gariana. I don't think so. My we'll have to so look. much better than yours. <laughs> I um, remember it. I remember let's it. Let's look. Dang it. This is like the deal where they throw the football thing and then they, they look at it and then they go, wow, that's embarrassing. <laughs> so keep it rolling, maybe. This is yeah, like, keep rolling. I'm going to look this up. Although in those commercials where they're doing the instant replay, they always make the guy look like a dumbass. And I don't like it. It's always got to be the guy like yeah. who's totally dumb and wrong. At least 50-50 it. 50-50 <laughs> would be nice. Yeah. Gariana, no matching videos. Mm. I call foul. There was one with a special edition, Collier edition that we did. That, that was one that John had sent us. But I I'm was, pretty sure this is our first Gariana. Oak, though. I remember it was their oak. We must have been on someone else's show and had it. I think it was the the four scotch helpers. They don't do bourbon. <laughs> I don't know. Or American I'm whiskey. Just throwing they do scotch. Stuff out. So, yeah, mm -hmm. but they would like American. So, I don't know. I feel like I've had this once before with Gariana. Maybe it was some other bottle and uh, I got a chance to pronounce it. So, we'd go with you. Sure. Oh, the, all of the Pete Weeks? John has sent us as well. Right. He was the one sending us the Westland oh, Pete Weeks. Yeah. Mm. Those and then he sent delicious. us the newest, the newest one, though, too, where they redid the core range where they had the, uh, it was single malt. Now, the new, I think the new one is American mm. Oak single malt or Which something like that. Which I was like a little that. lukewarm on, on fir at yeah. first. Then I went back and tried my original single malt, and I liked the new medley better. They're coming along. They're going to be... They're going to be huge. They're going to be, I think, premier in that uh, American uh, single malt category. They're already kind of there. And with the one that you saw, this is a nice follow-up to that Jack Daniels. Mm. American single malt's coming on. And uh, they were early forerunners in that movement. And they're going to be able to hang even with the big boys. I'm just calling it. I like this one neat. Even just a little bit drop of water, almost... Tone down the velvety. It, yeah. It's still good, but it had such a powerful open before the water toned that down. Um, I, yeah, I just liked it. I neat, 50%. Chocolate. Yeah, I think this is great neat. Um, I probably, per, I'm with you, prefer it neat just for the pizzazz on the front. It's got a pizzazz, a parazzarina, a parazzolata. <laughs> Now that I was waiting for you to go, for God's sake, shut up. Mm. Sorry. <laughs> I like that. I mean, all the same notes, I think we've pretty much touched on everything. There's nothing really else coming out with it. A little bit of vanilla, some cinnamon, some some, raz some berries, that sandalwood character. Nice. We still got to get out there and tour. John said he could get us in with a good tour if we yep. came out. Yep. I like it. Yeah, me too. That's good. They're doing great, great mm, things. Wow. The fifth. Decent, decent finish. It's not real. There's, it's not, uh, I mean, it's not real dark, real depth. Right. That's, that's it's really more of that but it's nice. It's lovely, f sweet finish that yeah. comes along. Yep. Little Almost grassy. like rock grassy candy. I used to have this rock candy on a stick back when you were kids and they didn't do much for candy. They were like, here you go, it's rock candy. Yeah. So, yeah. Sugar. Right. It's just, just cubed, cubed sugar. Yeah, cubed sugar on a you stick. Loved it. And you, you loved were it. like, this is great. You know, and then <laughs> I'm gonna go outside and play with a stick. <laughs> <laughs> That's we all we simple. needed. Yeah. Simple. Well, yeah go simple outside. Times. All I remember is mom would yell, get outside. And it was like a hint of anger. And you were like, yeah, and then you like blew outside and then you were there all day. And it was awesome. 90s. Awesome. Wow. 88. 88. 88. I got lost in my youth there for a second. 88. Yeah, I had to just shut that down. I don't want to climb on. trees, falling down, getting hurt. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Is that it? 100, $150. Ooh.
that's too much. <laughs> that's uh, pricey. I like it, but that's it's, too much. It's good. And the thing is, I've seen this for a while. I've just never picked it up because of the price point. And actually, I think I've seen it around here for 150 to 200 even, mm. uh, which is, which is, I mean, that's retail on it. Woo. Uh, it's still worth, it's still worth it. Well, what they're it's doing good. is nice experiments, it's, and this is a winner. It's high, yeah, but I think it's worth it. Yeah. <laughs> what I am going to tell you is, you can go to Patreon because we're going to need you to go to Patreon based on the cost of this bottle. Because you go to Patreon, you look up Scotch Test Dummies, you can support for as little as a dollar a month, but you can do a dollar show, five dollars show, and when we buy things like this. We need that help and support. Woo! Before I talk about thumbing and subscribing, what do you got? Just do it. Just hit the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, leave us a comment, we it all helps the channel. We need and it. go to scotchtestdummies.com. See, I just did that short I because like you'd you still be going. I was going to keep going. Go to scotchtestdummies.com. You can pick up coins, glasses, dropper set, shirts, hats, all kinds of stuff. It keeps the lights on. It keeps the whiskey coming. <laughs> scotch it. You scotch gods. Cilantro. Dummies. Dummies. <laughs>